what's going on today guys welcome back or to the channel um it is su sunday right now um at 7 23 in the morning um, i'm sitting here making food um kind of getting ready for today um today we're going to be chopping the mufflers off of the subaru um and we will be doing that because i'm getting ready to order my full exhaust system for the car uh this week i believe um and it's a very expensive exhaust and i don't want to buy the exhaust and it not be what i like so i think i want to go with no mufflers but I'm not 110 percent sure yet so today that's what we're going to be getting into i've had this idea for a couple weeks to do this now um but i wasn't ready to get the exhaust yet and my original plan was just chop it chop the mufflers off and drive it and see how it sounds but if anyone that's ever done anything with exhaust knows that going all the way out the back makes it sound completely different um, and throwing tips on makes it sound entirely different um, let alone four like the Subaru has so I wanted to do it semi right or get it like semi close to what it would sound like with this exhaust system that I'm, about, that I'm about to get. So I had gone to a couple places yesterday morning um, trying to find a place that I wanted to do this for me. Um, and it kind of blew me away what these guys are asking um, for to, you know, just do a simple thing to the exhaust like this. What I want is the mufflers chopped off and then straight pipes replaced. Well, I also noticed, and the guy that's doing it today doesn't know this yet, I just thought, like, noticed it last night when I was watching the video that I took. Um, I'll put in the video at some point for an exhaust comparison. Um, that the mufflers, or the, the four tips are attached directly to the mufflers. So, when I go to Advanced or AutoZone or whatever today with him, I want to see if they have, like, a one and a two pipe that we can weld on so I still have the four tip effect which is what I'm looking for because like I said tips alone make a huge difference and then you want to throw out four tips into it so it makes a big difference so hopefully we can find something that's kind of like that and I mean I guess these guys' prices like it was kind it was it was kind of high for what I'm doing um but with all the stuff that's going on the price is getting jacked up especially on metal um i kind of get it and it'd be cool if i was going to keep it that way but i'm literally junking it within this week or the following week so it wasn't worth me to pay what they're asking so the kid's dad that i raced with um i got a hold of him he has a shop um and he said he'd be able to get me in today which means a lot because he's closed today so he's actually kind of doing me a huge favor here to get this knocked out for me so i think that's gonna be it i'm gonna go ahead and eat real quick here um and then we'll be heading to his shop probably 8 30 ish 8 8:45. um to get there check it out see what we need and then we're gonna go to the store and get parts Alright guys, so we made it here, 
Um, I'm pretty sure he actually might have just pulled in. Um, he was right around the block. So, I believe. So, anyway. Nope, that wasn't him. I'm waiting on him. Once he gets here, we'll go ahead and um, probably check out the exhaust and what we want to do. Um, I don't think he's going to throw it up on the lift just for to see what size pipe we need and stuff like that. Um, so, we'll probably just look at it, check it out see what size pipe we need, go to the store, get the pipe and stuff that we need, and let him know what I need to do, because it's not just going to be a straight piece of pipe. <laughs> so, uh, waiting on him, and then I'll catch up with you guys once we're checking everything out. So that's going to go ahead and wrap up this video. Thank you guys for watching. Um, big shout out and thank you to Cody's dad, um, David, um, for getting this all done for me uh, last minute coming in on a weekend uh, when he didn't even have to come in uh, to his shop to get this wrapped up for me. Everything that we did today was under 100 bucks. Um, so if you guys are looking to get that like subaru rumble um this is under 100 bucks guys i'm telling you um now if you do exactly this um i will say it might not be quite as loud or something like that because i do have uh the cob down pipe on this car so it might not be completely identical but it should be really really close to it um all it is is you literally chop the mufflers off and you put a piece of straight pipe in that's it uh, David's shop is called Profits Automotive, I believe. Um, if that's not what it is, I'll go ahead and put a thing here. Um, it's only 10 minutes for me. I'm in Norton, Ohio. His shop is in Akron. Um, as far as I know, I haven't had a whole lot of personal experience with his shop. Um, but from everyone that I've heard, he does great work. Uh, never comes back with issues. Does things right. Does not rip you off. Obviously does stuff for a great price. Um, and has been very trustworthy from everything that i've heard about him and his shop so go ahead and check him out if you guys need some stuff done to your car um, he does everything from brakes and oil changes to motor swaps so big thank you to him for sure and then also big thank you to joey uh, for getting those drive-by clips that you guys saw where joey's house is it's in like a straight road area you can see everything it was safe to do there so i went ahead and had him record me doing drive-bys there uh he did a great job with it so greatly appreciate that so without joey and david this video wouldn't happen so big big thanks to them um that's gonna go ahead and completely wrap up this video guys thank you guys for watching if you haven't already go ahead and leave a like uh comment on what you think of the exhaust 
uh, comment any questions that you may have, uh, and definitely if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe. Uh, thank you guys for watching.